coronavirus or COVID-19 uh, has been really challenging. It was always going to be challenging uh, in the film world. It's taken just over five months for films to even start picking up again from where they left off back in February and March. It is very limiting, it's challenging. Even down to the simplest things of like wanting to help other departments or moving something, you have to think twice about what you come into contact with, who else is going to come into contact with it. So you're right, love. Yes, try the difficulty is the fact that we're creatures of comfort and we are comfortable in knowing we can do X, Y, Z. Like we can do this at work, we can do that at work. As a crew member, I'm the only one who really has any kind of direct physical contact with the actors themselves. Um, so it is a challenge and you are having to second think most things. For me personally, I have to make sure all of the props have been sanitised. We've had a mobile phone which has been used by the main, one of the main cast. So. I have to make sure that's wiped down before and after. It's just allowing time, giving everyone time to do their jobs. It was quite a strange experience to develop a short film just via Zoom and WhatsApp. I hadn't actually met Mikey or Scott in person before this project. So we kind of um, became virtual friends um, during lockdown, which is really lovely. In this kind of COVID era, it's been getting used to doing all of your prep over Zoom which is incredibly challenging when you come to environments like this. The only uh, time I saw this flat was on Zoom. Felix tuned in and then like did a walkthrough. So as a consequence, I kind of over-prepared. I brought a huge amount of uh, equipment with me because it's better to over-prepare than to under-prepare. Actually, in a way, it makes for a, a more pleasant filming environment because there's no, can't clamber all over each other. So everything just takes its time and people have to be more aware of each other's space. It's rather like Tetris, with bodies and with um, everything. My job is just to move anything and everything and partly the mass amount of instruments I have. We're in a lovely property here with plenty of rooms which have allowed people to uh, socially distance easily. We obviously asked all our crew and cast to isolate for a period before the shoot and enjoyed the slightly invasive tests as well. Myself and Joe I've felt so relaxed at all times. And that's only because everyone's been so safe and everyone's been so clear and the communication is fantastic, even through masks. It is tricky because you, especially when you're in close contact with the cast, that like you've got to be very aware of it. And I think the difficult thing for us was obviously the heat, which made the mask ring. It's a lot like a heightened thing. It has been an absolute nightmare in this weather, in this heat, when you've got casting, you've got really, you know, energetic scenes, you've got lights on, you've got windows closed, and it's one of the hottest days of the year and you're all wearing masks. It's a little bit difficult sometimes communicating notes with the mask on. Fraction slower on the turn as well would be fab. Fraction slower on the turn? Slower. Just a bit, thanks. All right. But if there's a choice between being able to work on a project or uh, not being able to work at all, you know, it, it's a small price to pay really. I hope people will take away from this just the kind of ability to do something at a time when it might seem like there's so many obstacles because we really have kind of overcome a lot to put this together. This project has been a fantastic testament to that it can be done, it can be done safely and I really hope that it sets the way for a lot of more films to come. Have you got an idea? Make it work, create something great.